What's up guys, Vernon here. Hoggy Boy Productions. I'm heading on over to have some breakfast, get some panisa from the Philippine Bread House. If you don't know what that is, that's Philippine bread, delicious. Maybe get some pandi cocoa and some sugar bread. Do another mukbang in the car for you guys. And I uh, hope you guys enjoy it. So uh, yeah, let's see uh, how this goes. And um, keep watching. Get some coffee too. All right, guys, I got a bag of goodies here. Pani cocoa, sugar bread, which is bicho, and panisa, and coffee. I gotta show you a little secret with the panisa and coffee that makes it extra, extra, extraordinary, there you go. <laughs> All right, let's get this started. This is the beet show. It's sugar bread. Look how uh, it's gonna be definitely messy. Mmm. <laughs> Sugary and sweet, definitely. It's like a long donuts, as they would call it. That stop took extra longer. I don't know what happened, but I didn't have to intervene. Mm. In 500 feet, go right on to Newark Avenue. This is doing a good job so far. Right on to Newark Avenue. Hmm. Driving pretty well. So yeah. Bicho. I call it chakwe. I think that's the Bisaya version. Sugar bread or long donut. I've heard it's called different names by some different people. Um, good dessert, good little mid appetizer snack. And this is uh, pandisal. Yeah, this is getting dirty already. All the crumbs and the sugar and the bread coming up. <laughs> I'm gonna have to vacuum this car. But uh, yeah. Mmm. Extremely soft. 
nice and airy, very bready. Get some coffee. Now turn right onto Broadway Avenue. Mm. It's good. I think one way, like I said, to make it your your panisal even taste better, dip your panisal into coffee, makes it even softer, gives it that extra flavor, and then just. It's the perfect wake me up in the morning for your breakfast. This is right, what it is right now. And it's super rainy. I think it's going to be raining the next few days. Oh man. Mm. You could also put like pan, um, pan salt. You could also put peanut butter, jam. I like to put peanut butter in mine. Gives it that extra kick too as well. Gives you that extra flavor for your bread. And yeah, perfect breakfast item. You know what, you're in Jersey City and it's all potholes and uh, road fixings. <laughs> it's crazy. Anyway, this is Pandi uh, Coco. This is coconut bread. It's bread with coconut inside. Let me see if I can open one and eat it for you. has a little uh there's a coating to it like makes it i guess i don't know if it's extra sweet but I'll take a bite mm. has that coconut filling gives you that extra sweetness to it it's delicious guys you gotta try it look for pandi coco it's called pandi coco coconut bread Also goes well with coffee. Mm. Mm. Tesla's been pretty good with the bumps. It's been detecting it and it's been slowing down. But this has been almost a perfect ride. I didn't even interfere or anything. I don't think so anyway. No disengagement. I just had to make sure you're always paying attention to the car. And uh, yeah, it's almost, uh, I guess it's 90% perfect, I think, for the ride. I have to save for a Tesla. 